Hi everybody, it's M6EB here. Um, sorry, I've not done a video for quite a while now. Um, but I just wanted to give you a couple of updates. First of all, I wanted to say thank you for all the comments and support. Um, as you might have seen my previous DMR videos, I did one on programming software, um, bits and pieces on how to do to do with the Titera radio. Um, unfortunately, I don't have that radio now. Um, so I, I don't. I've had a lot of emails asking about code plugs and help setting it up, um, and a lot of it I can't help because I don't have the radio anymore in hand to be able to sort of remember how I did it. I haven't had the radio probably for a good eighteen months now. I've still got the code plug on my website m6eb.com, which I'll leave a link in the in the description so you can go ahead over there, uh, download the code plug. Uh, just remember when you put it in the software from memory you've got to put your call sign and details in the code plug before you copy it to the radio but it should be fine anyway uh, but if, as I say if I can help I will you know feel free to email me contact me on the website anything you, you need to do um, as some of you may or may not be aware my father-in-law is a fully licensed radio ham he's G0 Hotel India Juliet and me and him have obviously um, been doing loads of different radio things over the years and years now that we've been doing it um, and Wayne's always wanted um, to have his own node stroke repeater it's always something he's wanted to do and I used to have a, a Yesu, I can't remember the model name now, it's the 100DR fusion radio, the mobile one you'll see it in the previous videos um, of, of the videos that I've done with it um, so what Wayne's done is he's bought one of those, I don't have it anymore unfortunately so that's that's another story but he's bought one of those radios now and he's also bought the Wires Xbox so he's also bought a dedicated PC so he's going to have it all set up and um, is me and him the other day we applied for the NOV obviously it's in Wayne's name because he's full license but we, we applied for the NOV it looks like it's all no problem it seems to be going ahead no problem at all um he's been issued the call sign um mike bravo 6 india papa romeo um for the node and i've obviously built this website as you can see in front of me uh, it's still a bit work in progress and we don't have the um frequency yet or any of more information than i've, I've put on at the moment um but obviously you can have a look at the website, I'll put the link in the description so you can see all about it. There's a bit of a blog on there. Um, I've created a Twitter account so we can put uh, any news information on there. Um, I've got a map there, as you can see, if you go to node details. As, as I say, we haven't got any more details on the location, which is in Ellswick, Preston, which is the northwest of the UK. Um, we did a bit of a, a test, not through Fusion, but we did a seven. It's on, going to be on 70 SEMS. And me and Wayne did a bit of a 70 SEMS test with his setup and my trusty old uh, Bofeng radio that I still actually do have. Um, and it was unbelievable. You know, that I'm probably a good 10 miles away from Wayne, maybe a little bit more. And it was like he was sat right next to me. Wayne's current setup at the moment is uh, tenor mast, uh, full planning permission. I think he's he's, uh, he's got a Diamond X300 collinear right on the top of the mast. It's it's about 15 meters above ground. Um, as I say, it's going to be running into this radio into the YZX on its own dedicated PC, um, and we're going to be doing the node. So that's going to be brilliant. I'll sort of handle any sort of um, computer side if I can, um, websites, questions, uh, obviously Wayne's um, going to be dealing with, it's his license, the, all the equipment's based at his house, so he'll be the one that's sort of in charge of it, but um, I said I'll help him in any way I can. Um, and then obviously this is the UK re repeaters on the Radio Society of Great Britain, and if we go down on here, there's um, the node there it's in new vetting stage so this is the one uh, Wayne Roberts G0 HIJ it's going to be a fusion gateway as I say I think it's all pretty much a done deal I think Ofcom just need to do the, the final bit and, and then it should be up and running so fingers crossed we'll be actually setting it up this time next week I would think if, if all's been well and then we can start getting it all 
go in and, and hopefully build up the hype for it because we are so excited. As I say, we've both wanted to be doing this sort of thing for so long now. Um, and Wayne's obviously decided that now's the time. He's bought the equipment, he's, he's done it, and we're going to go for it. So that's it, really. Uh, I'll leave the um, the website and everything in the description so you can come and view it. As and when I get more information, I'll put it on the site. There's a map of where it's located on the site. My email address is on here. Um, so any any information you want to know, we're more than happy to, to help you. I obviously I don't have a Yesu uh, fusion radio anymore, so that's something I now have to to uh, talk nicely to the to the wife for. That might be uh, another day, but we'll get there in the end. So this is M6CB, and thank you for all your questions, comments, all your support. I really appreciate it. Even though I've not probably not got back to all of you, I, I get inundated with the amount of, of questions I get, especially on the DMR videos. Um, but I'm going to try tonight to sort of get through a few of them and, and, and get through it and, and try and explain that I haven't got the radio and that you know I can only be as help as I can from, from memory. But we'll get there. So anyway, this is M6CB. Thank you very much for, for watching my videos, all your support. I'd love to hear from you um, and see what you think about the, the, uh, the node, any information you want and uh, I, I uh, look forward to it. So M6EB and it's also going to be with G0HIJ. So thank you very much guys and I'll catch you later. Yeah.